Hello everyone. In this Chinese New Year of the Ox, let me start by wishing you an auspicious New Year. This will be my last Chinese New Year message to you as OCBC's Group CEO before I retire in April. I've always enjoyed filming these greetings because it is a good way for me to reach out to as many customers and colleagues across the world as I can. I've always tried to find ways to increase our engagement and communication. With COVID-19, this virtual way of sharing my thoughts and extending to you my personal well wishes has become even more meaningful and necessary. Last year, the year of the red, was more difficult than any one of us could have anticipated. This COVID-19 just lingered on and there were recent reports of virus mutation. The good news, however, is the successful discovery of the vaccine and vaccination has already been launched in many countries, including our home country, Singapore. The Ox is known to be hardworking, tough and dependable. So with these characteristics, I'm hopeful that the year of the Ox will bring better prospects for our lives, our livelihood and our lifestyles. With the collective efforts of the governments all around the world and the resilience of the people, there are already signs of stability. For most industries, getting back to pre-COVID performance levels will still take some time. But we must not allow the emerging signs of moderate recovery to retreat. We need the momentum to continue in order to preserve and promote consumer sentiments and business confidence. We need to have the confidence that the government will do the right thing for all of us. Regardless of any bumps in the road, OCBC will stay resolute in ensuring that we do well, we do good and we stay strong. Our performance during the pandemic was both a test and a testament of our ability to protect our franchise, our people and our earning space. Our very strong capital and balance sheet will allow us to quickly seize new opportunities when the market turns. The post-COVID-19 future will be shaped by the people's changing priorities as a result of going through this pandemic, the new behavioural preferences prompted by advancements in technology, the increasing importance of China as an investment driver for this region, the growing demand for sustainability practices beyond climate change, but also the continued tensions expected in the global order. OCBC is correspondingly transforming for the future. We will broaden our markets coverage, expand our customer segments, offer new product lines and accelerate our digitalization journey. Many of these changes are already underway. OCBC will become more competitive and efficient as the world changes around us, as we have proven to be able to successfully transform and progress with the times as the longest established bank in Singapore and one of the oldest in Asia. Serving as Group CEO for the past nine years has been truly a fulfilling and rewarding experience. I am humbled and honoured to have the opportunity to work with my colleagues all around the world to serve our customers and communities. I am proud to have the opportunity to build upon the solid foundations laid by my predecessors to take OCBC, which is one of Asia's most iconic organizations, to new heights. Today, OCBC is more resilient, more regional and more diversified. Our fundamentals in capital, funding, technology and people resources are stronger than ever and this will position us well for continued growth. My sincere thanks go to all of you, our customers, for trusting OCBC and allowing us to serve you. I'm also grateful to all my 30,000 colleagues for their hard work and dedication. It is truly my pleasure to work with you since I joined the bank 14 years ago. I wish all our customers and colleagues the very best in the Chinese New Year. May you and your family have a rewarding, fulfilling and successful year of the Ox. 祝愿大家在新的一年生活安康事事如意祝愿做生意的生意兴隆财源滚滚也祝愿国与国之间和平共处互利共赢谢谢大家恭喜恭喜